We are gonna be spending the day with Mr. Ollie Man. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Yeah, show those people. What is up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having an amazing day so far. So we are down at the property right now, and we have a very exciting day for us. It is a very windy day here down in South Florida, but we are going to be spending the day with Mr. Ollie Man. Now, guys, if you don't know who Mr. Ollie Man is, that is our two-year-old male clouded leopard. Now, when we first got him a couple months ago, he was very, very scared. Of course, this is new sounds, new smells, so he was very hesitant to open up. But spending months with him, spending time, spending patience, he has blossomed. To to the most perfect little clouded leopard boy. And guys, let me tell you a secret, he only likes me. Now the last time you got to see Ollie Man on the channel was in his old enclosure. Now he was right next to Nebula, our female clouded leopard, but he has been moved. We have been working on this enclosure for quite some time. He has already been transferred to this enclosure and he absolutely loves it. So I'm very excited to show you that guys. And we are also going to be preparing his food and feeding him and just honestly spending the day with him. So guys, without further ado, let's hop straight into today's video. So we are entering the meat room, guys, and here we have it. Here we have our meat room. So we have a freezer literally full of meat for the cat. Let's open it. Let's see. And oh my goodness, guys, this is insane. We have meat for days. We are definitely prepared. And my mom is actually going to pick up some more meat. So we are literally prepared for a very, very long time. But in here, here we keep the meat that's chopped up. So let's go ahead and open it because we are going to be preparing Ollie Man's food. So let's see what this is. Okay. All right. And oh my goodness, guys, we have some yummy, yummy pork. So let's go pick this tin up. All right. Got a good grip, guys. It's pretty heavy. All right. Okay. Shut the fridge. And here we go. Let's take a look inside. Dun, 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 dun. Look how yummy. I mean, this is an absolutely amazing meal for a growing clouded leopard boy. He is absolutely going to love it. So we need to prepare his meal. So here we have all of our bowls, but we're gonna find the one that says Ollie. And we have our bowl. Let's go ahead and put it right here. But we must measure out how much we're giving Ollie because we can't just give him a ton of meat. We have to measure it out according to his body weight is how much meat he's going to be getting. So let's head to the scale right here. You guys are gonna see the process that goes on behind the scenes of taking care of these animals, guys. This is not for the weak. Now, in having all of these exotic animals in your care, it comes with a special requirement and dedication when it comes to the food, when it comes to the cleaning, when it comes to the all-around care of these animals, you must make sure your animal is happy and healthy and getting the proper nutrients he needs. So he's not only gonna be getting this meat, but we also have all of these vitamins that are also measured out. Because if he doesn't get these vitamins mixed in his meat, well then we could have a very weak cat because that helps them grow, helps their bones grow, and all around makes them a healthier cat. So we already got our glove on, guys, and we are gonna measure out Ollie's food. So we have our scale, we're gonna turn it on in three, two, and there we have it. Now I have to wait till it turns on. All right, it says it's set to zero. So we're gonna put our bowl right here. We have to set it to zero. All right, guys, we got it set to zero, and Ollie gets a pound, so we're just gonna go ahead Start taking giant handfuls, guys. You can see it's already cut up for our little clouded leopard boy. All right, let's see where we're at after we put this in. We are at 13 ounces. We are almost there. Let's go ahead. Let's take a couple more pieces. Let's see where we're at. All right, drop a few more in. Yep. And we're made it to a pound now. It's okay if it's a pound and one fourth because that is not too far off from a pound. So now that we got our meat in, we must add our vitamins. We got our vitamins in hand, guys. We're just gonna go on ahead and screw the cap and pick up our bowl right here and just sprinkle our vitamins all throughout our food. There we have it. Now before we can actually give this to Ollie, we must mix it up because our, our clouded leopard boy definitely does not want some powdery meat to eat. So we're gonna give it a nice good mix. Okay, it's getting somewhere. You can see it's mixing nice and good, nice and evenly. All right, make sure we get all of this mixed up. And there we have it. We got our meat nice and mixed up. It is looking pretty tasty, honestly, guys. I might just take a bite. Here I go. So now that we got Ollie Man's food nice and ready, we're gonna head to his closure and see what he's up to. So guys, this enclosure might not look like much from where I'm standing, but let's take a couple steps back so you guys can get a real view of this enclosure. It's literally insane. You could fit a house in here. Honestly, it came out absolutely amazing. Ollie Man loves it. And just take a look, guys. This 
enclosure is massive. We got a little wooden box right here so he can get protected from rain, from wind, from literally anything. He loves to hang out in here. We got a bunch of different platforms. We got logs everywhere that he can climb on because guys, if you did not know this, if you notice on a clouded leopard, their tail is extremely long. You guys are gonna see it in a minute with Ollie Man, but their tail is extremely long because when they're climbing through the treetops, they're actually using their tail to help them balance. That's why it is so long. It actually helps them balance more than you think. We're gonna see that in a second with little Ollie Man, but let's just take a look. So here we have our lockouts right here. They're not completely finished, but let's take a tour around the entire thing we're not only gonna take a tour around the outside but we're also gonna be taking a tour on the inside and guys you're gonna be my second set of eyes we're gonna see if we can spot Ollie man because during the day he really doesn't come out as much because it is so hot down here in South Florida yesterday it was literally 90 I mean I don't know what it is today but at least it's a little bit windy for him so let's see if we can see him is he in the hut guys <gasps> Guys, I don't know if you guys can see it because it's pretty dark, but we're gonna go say hi to you, buddy. We got some lunch for you, man. Are you excited? So we are going to do a whole tour around it. You can see that he has platforms upon platforms, logs upon logs to climb on. This enclosure came out absolutely amazing. Now, we absolutely love the enclosure. Ollie Man absolutely loves this enclosure. So guys, the only thing left to do is to head inside. We have the enclosure unlocked and we are heading in in three, two, and... Oh my goodness, Mr. Ollie Man doesn't know yet. Let's go ahead and lock the closure back up because we don't want Mr. Ollie Man going in the lockout. So we're actually gonna set our yummy food right here. And we're gonna see, see this little man. Now you guys haven't seen him in quite a while and you definitely have not seen him in his new enclosure. So let's climb up on here. Oh my goodness. I never seen a more beautiful little cloudy leopard boy in my life. Yeah, you wanna come say hi to mommy so everyone can see how beautiful you are? You just hiding in there? Are we gonna have to come up and say hi to you? So you can just hear little Ollie Man's cries. Yeah, we hear you. We hear the most beautiful one ever. But you can see he does not want to come out of this box right here. Now the reason is it's shaded, it is cooled, and he is away from the sun. Oh. Oh my gosh, guys, did you see those teeth? We're gonna take a closer look at them, but he just loves hanging out here in the day because it is so hot down here in South Florida, but we're gonna see if we can get him out. All right, Ollie, are we gonna have to come up and get you? All right, we're gonna set the camera right here. All right, little buddy, we're gonna set the camera up. All right, guys, let's see if we can get Mr. Ollie Man out. We're heading up here. I'm here, Ollie Man. Oh my goodness. Guys, look at him. He's coming out. Hi. Oh my goodness. This is the best boy in this world. Look at him. Oh, you want to check out? Guys, I think he's smelling the food. But just look how beautiful Mr. Ollie Man is. We weighed him about a week ago, and he is about 60 pounds of pure muscle. I mean, just look at him. He is one hefty boy. Guys, he's heading to the food. Oh, he is jumping down, guys. Oh my goodness. You want some food, my friend? Come on. Did the boys over there scare you? Here you go. Mommy protect you. Come on. Come on, my beautiful boy. Come on. You know you want the food, guys. He is coming up to eat his food. Come here. Put you right here. Oh my goodness. Someone is so hungry. Now, guys, just look how he is devouring the food. Let's take a better look at him. Oh my goodness. It's okay, Ollie. They're not gonna come and get you. Guys, look how he is just digging his ginormous teeth into this meat right here. He is chomping this food down. He is one hungry little kitty boy. But guys, I want you to take a look at his spots right here. They are not even and they're kind of all over the place and that's how they get their name, the clouded leopard, because their spots actually look like clouds. Now, I don't know if you guys can see it. We're gonna let him eat. We're gonna check out his teeth. But when he chomps down on this food, you can see, oh my goodness, guys. His teeth are ginormous. His teeth are about this big, and that's because the clouded leopards are the last living relative of the saber-toothed tiger. And I'm gonna say that again, guys. The clouded leopards are the last living relative of the saber-toothed tiger. And it's honestly totally insane to think about. But guys, he finished his food literally in like five seconds. You can see he's just licking the bowl. He's licking all the vitamins up. 
which is very good for him. And look at that pink nose. Look at this little man. Can everyone see this beautiful face that I'm always talking about? Oh, oh, say hi to the camera. Now guys, I want you to take a look right here. If you see those two dots, those are actually called eye spots. Now obviously they're not eyes, but in the wild, a predator may mistake these eye spots as actual eyes and it will scare the predator off. Now if a predator is creeping up behind him just like this, it'll look like their eyes staring right back at the predator and they will be immediately scared off. So that is something absolutely amazing that I love about clouded leopards. And also, the servals have that as well. Honestly, these are some amazing cats. So guys, you can see me and Ollie are hanging out on a platform and there he goes. He was literally just looking at something over there. He was hunting something down. He has something locked in his eyes. And this is exactly what he does when he sees something that he wants to hunt. He will actually lock down. You can see he's literally so still right now. He is not moving a muscle. He's definitely checking something out over there. Buddy, what are you doing? Look at this most handsome boy. Guys, this is insane. Look at him. What are you hunting down, buddy? Do you want to chin scratch us, my lover? Oh my goodness. Ah, yeah, ah. show those people, guys. Now you can see a uh, great look at his teeth. Did you see those monster teeth right here? So little Ollie man right here is taking a little pee-pee break. So we're going to leave him in privacy. But you guys got to see the entire enclosure. But another thing I wanted to point out is his water bowl. So you guys can see his water is clean, but is very, very important, especially in big cats and any exotic cats that you must keep their water clean because they are constantly eating raw meat now when they go to drink their water the calcium from the meat will actually get into the water and there will be a calcium buildup so their water has to be clean every single day we must scrub it with soap and water and it antibacterial so it's spick and span our cats are nice and healthy and i think ollie man agrees that he has one healthy little kitty right here oh my gosh look at this kitty butt right here yeah you have the cutest kitty butt of them all. i might i might have to say look at this he's one handsome little gentleman so guys, now that we're looking at Ollie from the back, I want you guys to see his tail. I'm gonna pick up the base of it, and I'm going, I'm going, I'm still going. And we have reached the end of his tail. I mean, look, look how long his tail is. I literally was not exaggerating. They have an extremely long tail, probably one of the longest tails I have ever seen in a cat. And this is used for balancing. I mean, look how thick this tail is, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you, you tell him, you showed him your sass. He definitely has a little bit of sass, but he is the sweetest little boy ever. And just look at him. Are you showing off? Do you know you're the most handsomest boy? All right, yeah, walk away with that sass, buddy. All right, guys, we got one happy cat. We got him a stick to chew on, and he loves to chew his sticks right here. And he is in his most favorite place in the world, which is under this platform right here, because during the hot South Florida hours, he actually goes under here to cool off. Isn't that right, buddy? Yeah. Oh my gosh, tell them you love it. Look at you, buddy. But guys, that's going to end today's video. If you all enjoyed today's video, spending the day with Ollie, feeding him, and getting to see his new beautiful enclosure, well, guys, give this video a big thumbs up. And guys, comment down below what you think we should do with Ollie next. Now, guys, if you want to see this crazy kitty again, let's see him. If you want to see this crazy kitty again, well, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel and the link down below.